Escobetti. Welcome to Spotless Stadium. Before getting on the plane to come here, I told the ticket lady send one of my bags to Melbourne, one to Sydney and one to Brisbane. She said she couldn't do that. I'm not sure why she didn't understand because, as I told her, the airline did it for me last week. Anyway, it's good to be back at Sydney. And joining me in the box for special comments will be Matthew Richardson. How are you, Dennis? I'm happy to be here today. Even though it's an exhibition match, Dennis, we expect that both teams will want to win. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The battle looks great and everything is spelled correctly. Mind you, I'm the last man to watch. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. We have the toss of the coin. Well, they say patience is a virtue, but if we wait any longer for the siren to kick things off, I'm sure this crowd will get a little unruly and maybe take matters into their own hands. The first quarter officially started. There is no glory in practice, but without practice, there is no glory. Munthard with first hands to the ball. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Hands like dinner plates. Dixon going through his routine. Unfortunately, they made the grass very short. Tactically, this week. Going for goal number one. Has it got the carry? That play is as high-tech as it can for. The Bulldogs get a goal. That's his first. The first goal by Smith. brief moment of serenity before the ball is bounced and the Ruckman unleash. Clean tap by Young. He gets his hands on the footy. Nice mark under pressure. Concentration comes out of a combination of confidence and hunger. And he's kicking on a 30 degree angle. This could prove difficult for him. Smith can only watch. Chalk up a goal for the Bulldogs. The Western Bulldogs have scored the last two goals. The Giants will have to start putting in some effort if they want a chance in this game. Smith will want to try and wheel around onto his favourite foot, but he's still very capable on the other. He gains possession. Munthan unloads one towards goal. His own is just on. Where to Western Sydney. No need to worry just yet. He'll be disappointed with that effort. They may have no option but to kick it long up the middle right here. Wood looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. Wood doesn't need to run to every contest just because he's just so great at reading the play. He can play a kick ahead or behind the play and still rack up possessions. Cameron goes for goal. Magnificent kick of the footy. Rest of the goal of difference, the Giants still in with a chance. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Munthan, I've seen better swings on a condemned playground. Hand passes, Young dodging for no reason at all. Good mark by Morris. As cool as a prize marrow as he lines up for this shot. Going for goal number one. Chalk up a goal for the Bulldogs. The Western Bulldogs over. The Giants 5-11. All is in readiness. There's the bounce. The Bulldogs are losing the clearances and they are sitting a kick behind the play and are able to stream forward in numbers and it's working well for them. He lays off the pass, gives it to the running man. He hits it. Smith with a bump. Taranto kicks the ball. A good contested mark there. Green puts it on the boot. Well, you can really tell he loves taking a contested mark. Bumps the big skid. 
A short handball. Booted by Young. Davis marks it. Clearing kick out of the defensive 50. A great effort. Border control will be keen to look at this traffic in. Shaw has a lot of passion for this game. You can see it every time he steps onto the field. He's an inspiration to all players around him. Well, it'll be a ball up right near the boundary line. Young kicks it. Dixon takes the uncontested mark. The goal for the Bulldogs. You can feel the intensity build as both Ruckman prepare for the bounce. Young can achieve anything he sets his mind to. The sky is the limit for this guy. Haynes taps the ball. Kennedy taps the ball. He hits it. Taranto taps the ball. Sending it on its way. Dixon gets the upper hand. As cool as a prize marrow as he lines up for this shot. 45 metres out. He's kicking from a 45 degree angle. A chance to add one more to his tally. Goal to the Bulldogs. That's two now. He's playing well. That's two in a row for the Bulldogs. The Bulldogs with the advantage as they lead Greater Western Sydney 30 to 7. Cordy laps up the misplaced footy. It's his. Young picks it. Hands like dinner plates. They're holding the ball as he's collected by Kennedy. Kennedy with a perfect drop punt. Strong mark. Well, yes, he is a bully, but he's not a mean bully. He's more a teacher, the kind of guy who'd take your lunch money and invest it for you. Williams, the better man there. Nice drop punt. Tomlinson wins the marking contest. A desperate kick there. Coming. Wins the marking contest. Slams it on the boot. Takes it well. Played on. Is that a throw? I think it was. Takes his time as he lines up for goal. It's okay to have butterflies. Just get them in flying formation. Testing shot outside the 50. Suckling holding the ball as he's collected by Kelly. Perspiring like it, putting in a pot as he lines this shot up. A monster kick will be required from here. Himmelberg tries his luck with a shot at goal. Greater yeah, Western Sydney won't be happy to see that scoreboard. Anything stands out there, Richo, with the stats? The Bulldogs with 17 kicks. The first break is finished, and play is set to commence. Never give up, never give in. And when the upper hand is yours, you may have the ability to win with the dignity that you absorb the loss. Tomlinson gets the interception on the bounce. A great effort. Haynes beats it wide. Stuck the mitts out and held on to it. Green picks it. Amazing specky by Young. That drop punt works well for Young. He takes control of the loose ball. Whitfield taps it, gets boot to leather. Nice mark there. Tringer pumping it long. Great mark under pressure. Suckling. It's got a decent leap on him, but there's still some room for improvement. A nice contested mark. Concentrating hard as he lines up the goal. Reed goes for goal. He gets the goal. GWS patrolling. That's one area of his game that does need improvement. A good mark under the circumstances. Johannesson has shown a lot of character in his recent performances. Great hands. He decides to play it on. He'll get a free kick. Cameron taking aim. Puts boot to goal. It's a mark. He lines it up with the goal. Kelly going for number one. Nice goal from Kelly. That's his first. Two goals can bring this back for Greater Western Sydney. You can feel the intensity build as both Ruckman prepare for the bounce. Punched by Mumford Himmelberg. Sticks out his hands and collects the ball. He's heading for home. Kelly ran to meet the ball and took the mark superbly. A chance to add one more to his tally. Nice hands. Himmelberg aiming for the goals. The Giants get scored. The last three goals. 
Less than a goal of difference. Greta Western Sydney still in with a chance. Himmelberg has a nose for goals. You wouldn't want to bet against him, even on the tightest of angles. With the ball now. Yup has had enough. It's a ball up. Munford really wears his heart on his sleeve. McRae gives away the free. Push in the back. He boots it. That's a nice, strong mark. He boots it. Haynes with a strong mark. He boots it. Scully marks the ball. Sending it on its way. Liberatore picks it up. He lays off the pass. Nicely intercepted by Cordy. Young with the running catch. He picks it up. The ball comes loose as he's taken down by Mumford. Big man does nicely. Handball short. McCray pummels in, but the kick gets away in time. He kicks the ball out of congestion. His foot finds the ball and brings it out of the pack. Davis globs the pass. Collected by it, sure. I haven't seen him for a while, Richard. Dennis, he just seems to be continually choosing the wrong option. Clean tap by sure. What do you think, Richard? Can he make this one? I won't be putting the house on this, Dennis. He might not get this. McLean sinks the long kick. That's his first. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. The Rucks can't complain about that true bounce. Mumford with the tag. Smith with the football. Exclamation point. How about that? Marked by Davis. Sends it on its way. That's my dear. Let's boot the ball. He gets it above the crowd. Jams it on the boot. Amazing specky by Morris. He takes the shot. Couldn't seal the deal. The Bulldogs with the advantage as they lead Greater Western Sydney 37 to 26. I would have expected him to nail that. Davis has got good knowledge of the game and he can see the events unfolding in front of him, but he just needs to react a little faster. He gets boot to the ball. Gets it off the ground. Hunter kicks for goal. Out on the full. That's terrible. Out on the full. Davis with no time to delay with that kick. Smith. That's number three. The Bulldogs leads by 17. The Rucks prepare to go at it for this bounce. The bounce is dead straight. Trenger really gets onto this one. Choose to kick it. Short gets the mark without contest. Time to see if there's anything interesting in amongst the stats. Neither team are giving an inch in the terms of marking. The Western Bulldogs won 23. A nice long halftime break, and we're ready for another half of footy. They've come out from the long break, and hopefully they have agreed upon the price they must pay for success. Doing this enables teams to ignore the minor hurts, the opposition pressure, and the temporary failures. Sends it into the open paddock. Cordy claps up the misplaced footy. It's his. That came off the boot with huge power. Great mark under pressure. Well, you've kicked a few in your time. Do you give him much of a chance from here, Richard? He should kick this. 40 metres out. He's having a ball. If he'll excuse the pun, that's his second. They're starting to stamp their dominance on this game. Morris has the passion for this game, and that shines through every time he plays. The Ruckman steal themselves before the bounce. More bounce than a dodgy chip. Mumford may not be the first guy you'd follow into battle, but you're glad that he's on your team, that's for sure. Puts boot to ball. He hits it. He knocks it down. Reed hands over the ball. The shocker of a kick. Poor takes the mark. He doesn't want to take too long lying this shot up. Puts boot to ball. He grabs it. He opts to play on. Picks it. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. Liberatore slams it on the boot. He shouldn't have bothered. Cordy has been violating the golden rule of kindergarten. He's not playing well with others. The Giants are in real trouble now. Disappointing kick there. Cordy with the mark. Cordy sends one up towards the wing. He wins the contest. Hunter is really starting to get into the right positions on the ground. 
sending it on its way. Haynes marks the ball. He boots it. He gives the ball away. He's got the footy in his hands. Johannesson swoops on the loose ball and will have a change of possession. Marks. Routine, strictly speaking, is not a routine if you have to think about it. Davis gets a free kick after throwing the ball. It's boot to Lever. Haynes wins the marking contest. That play is as high tech as it can for. Snicks the ball away in time. Good tap from Shaw. Tomlinson sends the ball on its way. The Giants just can't find a free man inside 50, and it's really having an impact on the scoreboard. A good contested mark there. He boots it. The mark will be paid. Williams slams it on the boot, takes it well. We get a hold of that one. Got his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. He gets a kick out of the pack. Nice mark under pressure. Heads up the corridor. Takes that one strong one. 50 meters out. Gets good to high. Young, the better man there. And he gives it a punishing kick. He's like he's on a tightrope at the moment. Look at that fancy footwork. Great mark under pressure. Can he kick it from here, Richard? This angle will test him, I reckon, Dennis. Morris shoots it. It's in the air. Misses the goal and goes through for a behind. Disappointing kick there. The disposal efficiency has been fantastic, but the Giants need to begin taking more gambles if they're going to cause some damage on the scoreboard. Dixon with the mark. I would have expected him to know that. Haynes, he's got a decent leap on him, but there's still some room for improvement. Williams puts his boot on it. He takes a strong mark. Johannesson with a terrible kick. He takes the contested mark. He slams that on the boot. McLean marks the ball. It's because a low ball. The opposition forgot about him, and he takes the easy mark. Richard, what are his chances from here? I reckon the distance might be too much from here, Dennis. Smith up and over. Smith going for number four. Goal. When he's on song, he seems a very good song. Smith increases the lead. Ruckman conscious of where their teammates are. They wait for the bounce. Big run from Cameron. Richo has some stats for us now. Both teams fairly close in the tackling stats. The Bulldogs 15. GWS 12. Neither team are giving an... And the last quarter of this match is underway. The game isn't over till it's over. Mumford aims for his man on the ground. Young has the ball. Batted down nicely by the ball. A short handball. Cordy sends the ball on its way. Dixon marks on the run. The ball finds its way into the grateful clutches of the opposition. The players have decided to take advantage. Great ground. The Giants haven't taken many marks inside their 50. They need to be more aggressive and create some room or they'll find themselves far too behind on the scoreboard. Kelly takes a shot. He takes the contested mark. Bumps the big skin. Hands like dinner plates. Plays it across half back. Marked by Neil Henderson. Picks it. Strong mark by McLean. Pizza. The mark is taken by Roberts. He steadies now in front of goal. The ball is slammed towards goal by Roberts. Through for a play. The Bulldogs starting to exert some dominance over Greater Western Sydney with the lead of 58 to 27. It's not the score he was looking for. He clears the ball. Haynes delivers a nice bump. Green taps it. Bontempelli shoots for goal. Bontempelli puts it through. The Bulldogs put in front. Both Ruckman had their eyes on the ball. A dead straight bounce. Knocks it down in front. He's got the footy in his hands. A clean pickup. Cordy with a perfect drop punt. A mark by Comfort. He gives it a punishing kick. 
coming. Rams have moved the ball and took the mark superbly. A great effort. Suckling clears it out of the 50. Takes that one strongly. Launch long by McRae. Controlled by Hunter Green. Bumped off the ball. Perryman on the ball at the moment. Nunthard aims for his man on the ground. Liberatore gets the ball out of the pack. Picture perfect drop pass. Great mark over the pack. Shaw picks it. Hunter presents and takes the mark. The ball being picked up before it makes its target. Haynes just got cleaned up and sent back to Neverland. Williams feeds it wide. Nice hands. Gets good to high. Great mark under pressure. Picks it across the ground. Takes that one strongly. Jams it on the boot. Got his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. That's holding the ball. He did have prior opportunity. Cool. We'll be praying he doesn't stuff this one. They've got nothing to lose here apart from this match. I would have expected him to nail that. An easy interception for Perryman. He was pushed. Low kick. Good mark by Bonton Pollard. Chips it down towards half forward. Out of bounds near the 50. The umpire will throw it back in. Look at the big eaters. They're doing their exercise now as this ball comes into play. Squeezes on a handball. They can't seem to maintain possession. They simply handed it over. Dixon controls it. The ball's come out of the pack like a chocolate bar from a slot machine. The Western Bulldogs get a goal. Dixon gets his throw. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Definitely pound to advantage. Picked by McRae. Well, you can really tell he loves taking a contested mark. Booted by Davis. Nice contested mark by Smith. Going for goal number five. That's six in a row for the Bulldogs. The Bulldogs by eight goals. And there's the bounce. Cameron with a big fist on it. Williams onto the ball. There'll be a ball up in the center square. Guided by Cameron. Himmelberg made the awkward bounce look easy. He's got great hands. One down by Cameron. The ball spills to Williams. Listen, here's the thing. This game is over before it began, and I don't think there's anything further I can add that will shed light on this outcome. Very one-sided. Richo, any last-minute thoughts? The Giants couldn't do anything up front. They couldn't honour a lead, couldn't break the lines, didn't try and move the ball quickly, couldn't take a mark. They were bad. They couldn't stop the Western Bulldogs run. Every time the Western Bulldogs got the ball, they went into their... Final scores are 76 to 28. That's it for us. I will see you again, but not yet. Not yet.